Hello. You're probably wondering why it's down here. And, oh my god. The camera's like, so... What the hell happened here? You know about this, alright? The camera's like two feet away from my desk. Why does it feel like it's ten inches? Alright. The reason why I'm putting the camera down here is not because of, like, my face. No, it's because it'd be better. Instead of, like... Look, I'll show you. I'll show you. Instead, instead of, like, doing this... It's gonna be weird, so let's put this down here so you guys can see a lot more better. Oh god, okay, this is it's gonna be awkward. I'll come back when I'm done fixing this. There we are, alright. Press to see where I have to put it. Okay, let's go right here. Alright, so what I wanted to show you guys was a lot of these things I started making back in 2016. I mean, I'm still making languages, it's just that now they're more better and more organized than how I made them today. If you guys can see that, that, that right there, ladies and gentlemen, that's a language I have created. They are known as the Argonauts. They are a red-skinned thorn species. That's their alphabetical order. Basically, that's how their writing looks like. And writing a lot of these things yeah, this is the reason why I didn't like this one, because I like the way they looked. It's just that I didn't like the way he had to say their name out, which was... God, what the hell happened there? This is just one out of... This one has a back. But this is like one out of a lot. As you, as you can see, there are lots. Even the back parts has the languages. They're all different languages. None of them are, none of them are like the same. They're all different languages, as you can see. I haven't really fully, these ones are the zeros. The zeros are a high advanced species that are tele telekinetic. The Argonauts, the one species that kind of look uh, Aztec kind of writing. The Glazes, which are a uh, fish species. It has a back too. Yeah, the Vekans. Yeah, the Vekans are the ones that have like this weird kind of Egyptian writing. Well, they've been around for around a million years. And here's the Nacrosins. The Nacrosin species. As you can see, if you get close enough, that's their alphabetical order. As well as the back too. Here's the zeros. Even it says their name on top of it. Oh my god. I'm not well coordinated right there. Their name can be seen. That is just, I have made over one, two, three, four, hold on. Oh yeah, four, five, six, and seven species. Not seven species, you dope. Seven languages of paper right here. Not seven languages. God damn it. Alright, seven papers, and each one has a language on both sides. I can prove that each one has their own language, their own kind of saying. God damn it. Their own kind of saying. Actually, this was my favorite out of all of them. That one and the Argonauts. These ones are the Charyas. And you got the ones that kind of look like an Eclipse kind of language, which is pretty cool. And you got one that just looks like a pointy kind of species language. And here's one that looks God damn it, one paper spell. Here are one of the other ones that looks a bit boring, but I was tired at the time. Yeah, so I have at least like twenty twenty eight languages I have created. I mean they all speak English. It was because back then they they didn't really let me get this in order. Okay, so the reason why all my aliens speak English and not this, I mean, they write in their own language. They just don't write in English language. But the reason why they speak English is because there's a backstory for that. I'll make a video and a backstory about that. Just, just that, that's just for another time. I mean, I would show you more, but that's pretty much for today's Wednesday. Unless you guys like... Alright, so I'll give you guys a backstory of why I made that, basically. 
So, the reason why I made all these was because I thought it'd be cool if they had their own unique language. Instead of my, my instead of me <laughs> relying on them speaking English, I thought, you know, every species should have their own language that they used to say before they before they found English writing. So, I just made their languages. I mean, I made another one, but I don't know where it went. Let me find it real quick. Why does it gotta be so damn hot in my room sometimes? I had a language for a species named the Falcoli, but I don't know where... I don't know where I can find it, though. It's like, it's, a, it's on a book somewhere. Well, sad news. I couldn't find it. I mean, if I could, I would, but I checked in my books. Damn, that was that was a really good species name too, man. <sighs> yes. <gasps> I found it. Yeah, I don't know what fell. <laughs> I don't know what fell. I found it. It was hiding in my little purple book, my blackfoot book. But here it is. The species name, oh, I didn't even say it, I didn't even read it, but here it is. There are, pretty much, this is their uh, vocabulary for their vocabulary, for their word. Like, in order to say my name, let's say, <clears throat> I'll show you how these work. So, in order to say my name, which is Damien, so, Wanko, so I gotta find a ko, so that's I'm at the I and A, B, C, D, E. Wan Khan, if there's two numbers, if there are two letters the same, you cancel one out and it can only be one. So Wan so Khan and the N. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L. Wan Kanawa. That's how you say my name in their language. If y'all don't believe me, that's how you say it. It's a little bit. Damn, this can't even pick up. But this is the Falcolized language, which is called Moan. No, no, no. Their language, the Falcolai language, is awesome. I actually spent one night making this. So, um, yeah, I think this is going to be it. It's a really, really sad downfall, but I just wanted to show you my past two years' work right here and one night's work. I just thought it'd be cool, you know, to show and really just pop off with all this, which will be, I just hope one day someone would review these and watch these and say he makes some really good stuff because, I don't know. Well, I guess that'll be it for today and yeah, and I guess I'll show you guys more on Friday when I talk about a species. The hub. Oh, so that's what's fell. My Febreze. <laughs> I don't know why I have a Febreze, but... Yep. I hope you guys like this, and... Make sure you guys do whatever, I guess. And... See you next time.